Hey, what's up? My name's Tommy. Welcome to Monday. We're having another theme week, I think. If Jason makes this video, then we are. So, this week's theme week, if you can't already tell, is going to be about the first week of college, which now me and Jason have both done. Jason's actually been in college since, like, September-ish. Something in September. Hopefully you'll tell them, Jason. Hopefully you will. But I've only been in college for one week. In fact, today is my fourth day of school. So, to get started, college is way different from high school. And the fact that you're having longer class periods and teachers can cuss. That was a shock to me. I would think it's a, you know, more refined establishment. But it, it's not. It's, um... Willy nilly, do whatever you want. I, I should probably tell you, I'm going to the Art Institute of Portland, if that's anything. For digital film and video, what, what? Hey, I'm filming right now. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Rufus. So, besides teachers cussing, which was a shock to me, I also noticed that my shoes, let me get them for you, these bad boys, which my dad used for when he went running a couple years ago, like a hood to coast race. Um, I don't think he used these in the hood to coast though. Uh, these guys squeak a lot. They used to not, probably because, you know, they're, they're falling apart. This, wait, this guy's not falling apart as bad as... This guy is the is the worst one because I can stick my whole foot foot in it. I can stick that in there. Um, maybe not. You can probably see it. The there used to be these things going up and down and all the way, and then uh, but in the inside's not that bad. Focus on me. Focus. Focus. Another thing that's different about college is that there's a lot more homework to one class. On my first day, I got eight assignments right off the bat. Some of them aren't due until next week. The next week from now, some of them are due today. So, I mean, it is college expected. It is expected. Another thing that I have to do now, going to college at the Art Institute of Portland, inside of Portland, and I live in Washington, I must bus back and forth because I don't drive and that'd be a lot more money to spend on gas. Busing back and forth takes about an hour getting there, even though it's a 35 minute car ride without traffic. So on the way back, when I'm always going to be in traffic, it takes about an hour and a half which is good, unless you got somewhere to be. So, that could be bad. At the end of the week, on Thursday, that's the end of my week, I had a meeting, with, which is basically a class meeting. Basically, a, the, there's five classes to the school, and by, we are the first generation to come up with class names and such. Like, this, this is the first time they're doing it. Hopefully, it will carry on wayward son for generations um, and I'm pretty sure we named ours Phoenix so if any of you people go to the Art Institute in the future and you join the group Phoenix I started that I didn't come up with a name but I was I was I was an original member and at that meeting we have a group of like 35 kids in the guild and a total of five students and one mentor showed up so it was a lot of fun but no it was good it was it was a fun meeting we played a game called werewolf which is like a card game which is a lot like murder mystery like there's there's like the angel the murderers the detective the regular people but it's with cards, so some people have special abilities. And it's, it was fun, even with only the five people playing. I, I really, he said, 
our mentor, uh, Mike, I keep calling him Mark, Mike, uh, he brought the game and yeah, I understand that you need like 35 people to play it or something. Bigger groups, more fun because then people start getting killed off. You don't know who it is because it would, it would be one round, one person might get killed off and then everybody would go, I think this is the person. And then depending on who that person was, you either win or lose because the next time someone's going to die. So we can play, it's two round games for the five people. Uh, but yeah, college. Fun. Highly recommend it. Um, I think that's all for me. So, keep it positive. Hopefully you'll see me next Monday. And in the description there are tickets that you can buy to go see my musical that I'm in called Bye Bye Birdie. I play Albert J. Peterson, which is Conrad's manager, who is the star of the show. Please go check it out. Uh, tickets... Uh, winning stat theater costs about twenty one seventy five. I'm pretty sure that's the cost. Uh, or you can go pick them up at the door, or beforehand at the door. Whatever you want, please just buy some tickets. That's all for me. Bye.